Well, these two teams with a lot of things in common, including the ability to overcome injuries. John Coble, Tyler Ford, Natalie Sago, our NBA officiating crew. Actually, Johnson is in uniform. It's 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 Dragic and Whiteside who are out tonight. Derek Jones and James Johnson are back. Trevion Graham. He brings toughness to the Nets lineup. Missed a lot of the season. Missed the 20th game of the season for Brooklyn. Yeah, and, and this is the interesting matchup where Kelly O's got a 6-5 Graham guarding him. Winslow with a gorgeous rainbow triple. 77 feet for seven points. Big time shot for Bam. That's a tough touch shot. He's able to convert that with the mid-range J. Russell able to flip in the little left-handed shot. D'Angelo Russell for November at Minnesota. We're so happy he's back. Joe Harris got the block. Bam missed, but not the second time. Boy, Bam, quick jump. Deion's missed his first three shots to open the game. D'Angelo Russell, perfect looking through. Down's got a great wingspan, good rim protector. Richardson hits a tough one coming across the line. First score for Jared. Nice pass by Jay Rich. Winslow puts it in. <laughs> he was off to a great start this year when that dislocated foot injury sort of unplugged him for a good part of the season. Richardson rips another one. Good close out by Winslow to prevent Russell from shooting. This is Levert kept the dribble alive. Allen banks it in. First score for the second year center. Averaging 11 points. Halfway through the first quarter, he ahead by four. Olenek for three. Come on. That's have made a couple of changes. Rodion's Kuroots is in. Joe Harris buries a three. Leads the league in three-point percentage at 47%. So Alan Crabb and Kuroots are in. Winslow scores again. Magruder defending Spencer Dinwiddie. As Kuroots comes in, what a dunk. Now this very intriguing rookie who's averaging eight and a half points per game for Brooklyn. Yeah, a 26 point game against the Heat last season in uh, last January. Here's Magruder. Kaboom. Rodney Magruder. Good to see a three drop for him. 68 of them. It's just a, a well told story about young Karis Levert who went through three surgeries on his other foot while he was a college player in Michigan. That's a three from Derrick Jones out of the left corner to open the second quarter where the Heat have an eight point lead. This is the biggest lead for Miami so far. Oh, cool. It's got in front of Derrick Jones. He's been a, a load for Miami. From being overly aggressive attacking. Two coaches that have a lot of respect for each other. Oh my, speaking of respect, Derrick Jones earning his. The defense by Derrick Jones Jr. Carroll, no airspace. Four on the shot clock. Ed Davis converts from about two feet away. Russell using the crossover. Now the pullback. Ooh, that was James Harden esque. James Harden, who scored point lead for Miami. Deion Waiters back in the game for the Heat. Olympic and Ban both back in. The Kelly keeper for the basket and the foul. Good work by Olenek. Yeah, the playmaking ability. Justice Winslow's back in the game for the Heat. He replaces Josh Richardson. Raiders on Levert. Nice move by Karras, who flips it in over Pam out of Bayer. Eight on the shot clock for Dion and Miami. Olenek. Kaboom. They're killing Olenek with the Heat's last six points. Evenly played, interesting half so far here in Miami. And the Nets for so much of this first half. Packed into that 2 3 zone. Oh, perfect hook for Bam. Uh, bread basket for two. Get you a roll. Want to get you a roll at halftime. Harris, uh, he's been on a roll this year. And Carroll sit down for the Nets. Harris trying to dribble it through the defense. McGruder comes up with a steal. Winslow on the attack against Dinwood. Oh, good. Good change of motion for Winslow. Everyone in Heat Nation and around the nation do. Those two free throws for Dinwiddie, his first two points of the game. Olenek parked and proficient. He has seven points for Brooklyn. Miami has a five-point lead with under three minutes left in the half. Olenek and oh my, 53% shoot. Best is yet to come here in March for Kelly. Eight-point heat lead, Winslow's runway rolls in. Justice Winslow, he only has three rebounds. The net starting center, Olenek. Occupies him and scores.
A killing Olenek showing his full bag of tricks. Just two points in his seven minutes. Graham, the 25-year-old out of Virginia Commonwealth. Nice spin by Dion. Well, that ends that heat run after 11 straight points. Richardson had the hang before hit. Rebound on Russell. D'Angelo Russell, who scored 10 points in the first half. Set up Harris. Seventh assist for Russell. Ninth point for Joe Harris. Yeah. He's done a good job really matching up. That's the first real open one he's got. Against the zone, Olenek from Bam. Kelly Olenek popped it in. He has 18 points. Tied his season high with three blocks in this game. Just under eight minutes left in the third quarter. Harris, nice finger roll. He's having his best season in the NBA. Yeah, he's mixing up his game so well, too, Eric. Getting to the rim on the drive. Oh, what a perfect pass. The Olympic flip and the foul. What a great look by Winslow. That's in man-to-man -man on this trip. Four on the shot clock for the Heat. Kelly on the catch. And Kelly is red hot. He has 23 points in the game. Gets his 14th rebound of the game. Winslow. Gets his own miss back after it was deflected. Waiters buries it. Mm -hmm. An 18-point lead now with four and a half minutes left in this third quarter. Oh, great pass by Ben. That's a terrific feed for the Derrick Jones Jr. layup. He's operating pretty efficiently against it, shooting 47% with only seven turnovers. 23 points for Olin. Bam, another nice dish. Jones and a foul. Damari Carroll with a rebound. He with a 21-point lead. Carroll off the spin, able to score. Lamari Carroll, he missed 11 games this year with an ankle injury. He went. had a very quiet game. He's missed all seven of his shots. No one. A three for Wade. A minute left on the third. This is Magruder. In a jam and out with a short jump shot. Five points for Magruder. Haven't been able to be that lockdown type defense you need to be in the second half, particularly the fourth quarter. Magruder's three right on target. Rodney Magruder's two threes tonight. He's got eight points. Hollis Jefferson gets his first two points of the game from the free throw stretch. Well, oh, Brian Grant, what a, what a great guy. Great, excellent player here. His teammates with him in, in Portland. Just a great person. Wide open three for Robin. Kaboom! Rodney McGruder. He now lead by 26, 92 to 66. Jim Harris puts it in with both hands. Got a foul on Richardson. And Brooklyn's lead over Detroit would be ever so slim. If at all. Derek Jones Jr., what a move by him. He's got 17 points off the bench tonight for Miami. Points and, and be a productive player in limited minutes. Well, he's tied his season high and his career high with 18 points. Hollis Jefferson rings it through with a left hand. All four of his points. They're in Atlanta Saturday and then play the Pistons in Brooklyn before embarking on a seven-game road trip middle of the month. That's a pretty follow dunk by LaFerre. Of the UD Wade inside the heat were the two heat icons interviewed each other late last season. By the way, each game will include pop-up features with facts and tidbits about Wade. Some points for Wade, four of them here in the fourth quarter. The Heat have a 27-point lead with six and change left. Now Wade wants to get this on that Sunday showcase. Now such a positive effort for the Heat and a bleak performance by Brooklyn. Richardson, nice cut, good finish for Jay Rich. He has a dozen, and the Heat lead at 105 to 77. Yeah, Heat big men just facilitating so well. If it's not Bam, it's Kelly on the last possession, finding Jay Rich. Rody Kuroots in the seven out of eight at home to begin March. Yeah, I think so too, and I just love the way they've answered here. Look at Duncan Robinson knocking down his second shot. The Heat will also be just one game behind Charlotte, and they lost the first two to the Hornets. So Wednesday's game in Charlotte, another of those must-win scenarios for Miami. The Heat have done it. They lead it end to end. 117, the 88, the final score. The Heat take a two games to one lead in the season series.